and welcome back to the Forklift Certified Gambling Podcast. I am your host, Forklift Certified Gambling on IG, Forklift Certified <laughs> Gambler on TikTok. We're my co-host, the waviest man alive. The man, the myth, the legend. The man with the plan, folks. <laughs> We're coming at y'all again. Thank y'all for tuning in. Last week was a good week. Uh, we're going to go through a little recap before we get to the picks for this week. But uh, we had a shabby. decent, had a decent shabby, week. Man. It was really just a good myself. Sunday. But, um, yeah, the, man, the uh, man. alternate spread, I keep calling the money line. The alternate spread, Round Robin went four for five. Cashed. Um, I went three and oh on my week. Cameron, you went two and one. Five and one on the week. That's I will a, finally win dry, man. Man, yeah, I've Miami. Been, I've been putting. I said I gotta keep feeding the crops, man. I gotta water my corn. But yeah, hey, they paid the bills from me, man. The, I mean, six and Can't zero, get, seven and zero against the like Dolphins now. That's kind of a yeah. The a, Bills own the. I Dolphins, wish I would have so. known that before. I would have done that, but I, I mean, yeah. Hey, we're rookies here. We're, we're we starting. know it we're for starting. the future. We're it's um, only season two. Wait till season seven. Boy. Yeah, we. I went. <laughs> Took the West Coast trip, had the Chargers by six and a half, Niners by 14. Uh, who else did I have? Oh, I had the Rams money line. That one was a fucking sweat, I'll tell you that. But came through in cash, went 3 0 on the week. Um, oh, man, yeah. You had uh, Tampa Bay as well. That was. Yeah, Tampa Bay came through. Never in doubt. Man, Baker was baking. Baltimore, yeah. I mean. I like to think they might be someone that's part of the AFC North. Like, they might be the. You see me up there? I'm just saying. Baltimore. He did say Baltimore. North. I took it. I'm just saying. It's tough division. They play a uh, boss to wall football, but yeah, um, they play the Steelers this week, and I mean Cincinnati's is. not looking like those guys. My picks kind of. Since he's looking pretty sad right look, now. They always start slow, but but yeah, he's right. Yeah, yeah. yeah. They, they start slow yeah. like a steam engine. Joe's slow, next looking. Thing you know, too much powder. Yeah. Um. All right. So Thursday night, I had a bad Thursday. Rough. Went one and two. Sunday went zero and one on the prop. Monday went one and two. It really wasn't nothing at home to write about, folks. We had a good Sunday. Sweet. What, it, what like for all I'm gra- like grasping from this is mm. uh, we suck at prime time. Yeah, in the prime time, <laughs> you might want to fade us, folks. I, I, I agree. I, can't I didn't know. I mean, but um, we imagine definitely... if you were to comment and talk wet to us or talk some trash. It would, it'd be <laughs> some ahead, fun, it'd be some fun interaction. Feedback if you is it, I mean... always preferred. <laughs> you know, go ahead, throw anything y'all want in the comments. All I know is you guys are too sad. Man, look, we're trying to give y'all some sharp plays. We still had a good week. Too shit. It, it's, yeah. been, it's been sad, bro. Um, it's been we're on sad. to the new week. We're NFL week five. We're shit. Pretty much a quarter of the way through the week or it's through flying. the year. It's flying. Yeah, it's flying by, it's man. We done done some yeah. upgrades. We got an in house producer now. Shout out to uh, Momo. Shout out, Mo. Mo in the background. Um, we're moving <laughs> on to the new week, man. Let's go ahead and start it off. <laughs> Shout out, Momo. All right, what, what we got for our first pick of the week, Cam? Right, Top first three. Pick. What, what am I pulling out? I'm I mean, Sexy Sunday. Well, it's, my, it's my well won dry. I got to go back to what I believe in the faith. Who we got? Tits by three. Titans by two and a half. Tits I by mean, two and a half. They're all Indianapolis. We're playing, we're playing against Indianapolis. It's usually a corn flip. We win one, they win one, but I mean. Yeah, I like it's the Titans. This week. I, we, we, we looked good last week. We looked bad a couple mm. weeks beforehand. This is really going to be the first week that actually shows us if we're going to be a contender or not. For real. So, I mean. While you got it, do it while you can. Tighten up, baby. Get it while you can. You got to tighten up tighten on it. Tighten up. You got to tighten, tighten up on them. Got to get some money down on the tits. We're on it every week. And, uh, I mean, this is one of the spots that you take Tennessee. They started as a dog, but now they're moved. And, I mean, the money's coming in on Tennessee. You got to you gotta back them. Uh, moving to my first, I guess, lock. Who we got? I've been going back and forth. But I know I had this one since the beginning of the week. I got to take the Niners by three and a half. I don't care what Dallas is talking about. I don't care what anybody says. There is too much money coming in on San Francisco right now for this line to not be upwards of four, four and a half. So, I mean, the value is on San Francisco right now. This is this is a smash spot. The Niners are a lot better than the Cowboys. They're, the, the Cowboys' offense really ain't looking what it was looking like. And they just had a... Uh, We'll Coming say up. this, the Cowboys lost to Arizona. Exactly, that's what I was getting at. <laughs> they lost to Arizona. That's and the sad. Niners covered the number. Backdoor covered, but, you know, covered nonetheless against Arizona. And, um, yeah, man, I got to go rock with the Niners this week. What you got, Cameron? What's my next one? Mm-hmm. I guess we'll go with Louisiana 
the NOLA. Going down to NOLA. I'm taking NOLA. Who are they playing this week? Good question. The Pats? And yep, the Pats. And we yep. beat them by one. Yeah, Mac Jones is not looking like that guy Nola this year. NOLA by one, minus one. Take it while you can. Because, yeah. I mean, and like you just like, like Matt Judon. Exactly like you're and, saying. And uh, Christian uh, Gonzalez. So they lost two of their defensive players, the best defensive players. and uh, Losing some defense, and they've been known to lock down some defense. Yeah. I mean, rough defense. You got Kamara back at home. Yeah. Chris Alave starting to work around some stuff. Card actually played I last mean, game. Card played plus. last game. He didn't look too bad. I mean, he's not looking the healthiest, but, I mean, give it a week. It's been a week now. Let's, let's put him out there. Like, they I got, like it. They're trying to win the Super Bowl. Yeah. Come on, let's like. This uh, is t- take the make or break here for New Orleans. This is. So, I, I'm definitely with that spot. I don't like Mac Jones or the Patriots or anything right now. I, like I know the, the trade for I, Jason I like Jackson. The, I like the Billichick strategy, but I don't think I don't think it's working. Yeah, no, he's not looking like the same without Tom. I don't think he's looking that good right now. Um, all right, all right. So, we got two for you. Who am I taking for my next pick? <laughs> um, so you, what you got? Man, I know this is a shitty, stinky booty pick of the week, folks, but you got to hop on it, man. The Arizona Cardinals, plus three right now, they're just begging you to hop on Cincinnati right now. They are begging you to get any money down on Cincinnati. Folks, it's a trap. If it gets down two and a half, it's a trap. There's so much money has been pouring in on the Cardinals. It's a trap. And it has not moved. It's a trap. I can't get on Cincinnati. Joe's look bad. He looked bad against the Titans' bad secondary, right? I mean, am I right? Am I wrong? Joe usually owns right? the tits. Joe owns the tits usually. Like he's, he's not looking like the same guy. He's, 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 like, he Joe got his money and he ain't looking like he used to. Yeah, so I'm back in the Cardinals this week. Josh Dobbs, I mean, former Titan, not a lot of back him. Could have been a fucking astronaut, but look, quarterbacking for that's true. What is a sneakily good team and. um the Cardinals kind of been a covering machine this week. They would have covered last week against the Niners if it weren't for a couple drop uh, touchdowns. But yeah, man, we're uh, we're rocking with the Arizona Cardinals this week. I know it's shitty. I know it's stinky, but it's pretty booty too. But I mean, we're on it, folks. You gotta let the Cardinals we're on do. It, folks. We're on it, Cameron. I guess for my last pick, final? I'm going back to the roots. Shout out G Pa, yep. man, the myth, the legend. The one and only cheese head, the man who raised me on Brett Favre. The biggest cheese head. Oh, uh, he's a pretty big cheese head. Cheese head no more though. No, he he renounced the cheese head. He he said the biggest cheese head. I can't live that life no more. It's not for me. I've retired. But anyways, point being is you gotta go with Green Bay money line. Green Bay money line is a mean, smash spot. Jimmy G is looking pretty sad. Josh Jacobs, he's pretty solid, but I mean. That Las Vegas team is falling yeah. up. Josh McDaniels right is a terrible coach. It's just crumbling. <laughs> yeah, McDaniels is really the butt end of memes every week, and nobody wants to put money down on that guy. Like it's it's hard it's, to bet with Vegas. Yeah, they got a lot of good players, but I mean, like they're just not getting it going. And Josh McDaniels has not been that guy this year. So we're uh, we're bringing it to y'all, folks. Had a, we got the Sunday spot. We got the Sunday prime time. We got Monday prime time. Um, What's your last pick? Who am I bringing y'all from the last pick? Ah, uh, uh, God, this is a tough one. I've been going Insert back and forth. Drum roll eventually. Um, yeah, no, this is a fucking yeah. tough one. Mm. God, folks, I didn't want to do it too. But it's a system play. Mike Tomlin at home, plus four against the Ravens. I know, folks. I know. I really didn't even know if I was going to bring it to bring it to y'all, but you really brought Tomlin out. Oh yeah, yeah, bro. This is a Tomlin dog spot. Every time that we've taken an uh, AFC North dog this year, it's cashed. Week one, we had Cleveland against Cincinnati. Cash is an underdog. Week two, I believe we had um, Baltimore playing against Cleveland. No, no, we had. Pittsburgh against Cleveland, they cash as an underdog. And then last week, we had Baltimore against Cincinnati as an underdog. Cash, folks, it is a system play. So you're telling play. me 
the Steelers beat Baltimore, so the AFC is just the AFC oh, I beat you. Oh, you beat me. Oh wait, I beat you. They don't but then beat you beat each me. other by more than a everyone's field goal. just pointing at each other. It's like rock paper scissors. Yeah, shoot. it's like no one's actually game. good. They're all just beating yeah. each other. You know, I looked at something today that the Titans. Well, everybody in the AFC in South right now is two and two. Listen to the video. <laughs> <laughs> but um, yeah, folks, I had to bring y'all the Steelers plus four. I mean, that's that's great value on a Tomlin team at home. Like, it's a systems play, y'all. Y'all just gotta go ahead and smash it. Um, we brought y'all the Sunday six pack, so you know what that means. It's time for your weekend fuck it. We had to bring y'all the hold up, what was it? The fuck it. Yeah. I don't got the pipes the camera does, so I'll leave it to him. But uh, yeah, we had to bring y'all. We're trying something new. We're trying something new. We see what yeah. I mean. Um, <laughs> little sprinkle of this, little sprinkle. Yeah, of this. The, the, this uh, fucking of the week actually is a little bit of sprinkle of this, sprinkle of that, because we're not doing straight underdogs. We're not doing alternate spreads, but we got a little something coming here for y'all. I don't though. even know what we're doing. All right, all right, we're all just right, doing right. it. We're doing stuff that you ain't never seen before. All right, all right. Who we got? It's provocative. First. It is provocative, folks. What's we had to bring it to y'all. Steelers money line. Just Steelers money line. The AFC North joke. Yeah, they're, Every, they're all. Everyone's just, it's rock paper scissors yeah. Rochambeau. Like if you're a dog, go ahead. Might as well sprinkle something on it. Get all right. while you can. We got Steelers money line. Mm -hmm. I think we gotta go out to the desert after this one. I mean, if we're yeah. throwing plus three, plus four dogs in there. Arizona against Cincinnati, man. We we got a well, smash with that one. All right, we got two. What are we thinking? Nola minus two. I mean. Nola minus two. Okay, okay. Doesn't seem too shabby to me. Yep. Um, who else we got? See them easily winning by three. I mean, I can even see like, what'd you say earlier? All of Las Vegas, all the betting money is stuck there on Miami. Yeah. Win by the spread. I mean. Yeah, Back there's literally, covered, folks, 100% of the money. Giants by nine and a half? Yeah. Yeah. This, G this line's too give, big. Give them nine and a half? Like, come on now. Like, come on, folks. It's this, still nine and a half points. 100% of the public and 100% of everybody betting that like, game is on Miami, folks. Vegas doesn't let you just walk away with free money like that. Like, no, no. Vegas always wins somehow. So, New York Giants plus nine and a half. Who else we got? What was the last one? Rams? Rams. Money line, or do we have Rams by three? No, no, we have somebody else. We gave you New Orleans, we gave you the Giants, we gave you Steelers, Arizona. I'm drawing a blank here. I can't read my own handwriting, but it's weird. Oh my is. goodness, here. <laughs> oh yeah, Green Bay by two and a half. Oh, GB, yeah. Folks, I'm, I'm sorry. We, <laughs> I forgot, we, I went back to the G We G were set. cooking this, and this is literally <laughs> the last forgotten leg every time we talk about it. Yeah, Green Bay two, by two and a half, folks. On Monday night. <laughs> We That's gotta funny. smash. Gotta smash. We brought y'all the fuck it. We brought y'all the sexy six pack. Or the Sunday six pack. I like how he reads my own handwriting better than I can. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. Sometimes you just need a buddy who need, can read your That's handwriting, true. folks. Yeah, That's true. Get yeah. your friend like I got you. Yeah, we got y'all another week, man. Thank y'all for rocking with us. Thank y'all for subscribing. I appreciate y'all. Liking. Please like, comment, subscribe, share Don't with the buddy. Don't forget to hit the share button. And the little exactly. notification, you know, every time we drop the video. We'll let you know, folks. We got the picks coming for y'all every week. Appreciate it, y'all. single week. week. This has been the Forklift Certified Gambling Podcast. Peace. Deuces.